Greetings out there in YouTube land. This is Morris, man. And as always, I thank you guys for coming to my channel. Uh, recently, I've been running a tremendous deal on the DVD songbook lessons, the entire songbook lessons, 27. There's the list down there for only $80. If you were to purchase these individually, $15 per DVD songbook lesson or songbook lesson, it would be over $407, somewhere in that range. So, you know, $407 versus $80. It's a no-brainer. And I just posted that I was, you know, by popular demand that I was going to extend it to Friday, which was yesterday. And I've gotten a lot of people uh, inboxing me saying that, you know, due to the holidays, I'm out of town. I don't have access to my PayPal account. By the time I get back home, getting ready, geared up for work the next morning after the, the Thanksgiving holiday, uh, your, your offer was over or would be over. So could you please extend it to Monday? And I'm going to oblige that because this channel is about helping you guys out. Because I got a pretty interesting uh, statement from a guy who I quickly blocked. Uh, I like your tutorials, but now you're doing a lot of sales pitching. What I'm doing is just making you aware of what's available for a tremendous price. This is not about me making money because, I mean, you'll be surprised how much I make in my studio work when I do studio gigging, and I do a lot of that. So if you knew that, you'd be like, well, why are you doing this if you're doing this? Real simple. This is about helping you guys. This is not about lining my pockets with money because I'm good. Trust me. You know, it's about passing on information. Because when I first started to learn how to play guitar and learn how to read music, I was really excited because I'm like, now I'm going to go out and bow the Rick James songbooks and the Confunction songbooks. And I was quietly, quickly saddened to believe and disappointed that those books don't exist. You know, they didn't print some books for this Rick James albums. And Rick James used to sell out arenas all over the world back in his heyday. So why not there? Why wasn't there at least one song book for an album? Now, Stevie Wonder was a very smart guy when it came to the business of music and Earth, Wind & Fire. Just about every single Stevie Wonder release was followed by a song book. You know, so it's like, because a lot of people don't realize you make more money as an artist doing publishing and you're writing than playing. Because once you stop playing, you stop getting paid. You write, you keep, you don't get paid till you die and pass over that residual income to your kids and to your kids' kids. So, unfortunately, uh, the record companies were not trying to help these artists as far as this is how you can sustain wealth instead of going back out on the road when you're 60 years old trying to still make money. You know, so... uh Unfortunately, uh, a lot of those great artists from that area didn't release the songbook. So, you know, uh, I took the painstaking task to kind of figuring out a system to how to tabulate songs. And apparently it works. You know, I got over, what, 2,000 videos and I had like four, but I had to take some down. I got another channel because I was right. I was doing so many covers that it's like, uh, you know, the numbers were increasing. So I had to split it down the middle. And, and send some uh, some of the songs over to my six Morris Man 64-2 uh, video or uh, channel. But I found that statement to be interesting because this is not about me. It's about you guys. It's about letting you or allowing you to learn to play these songs that you grew up loving. You know, and you can't go to the music store and find the sheet music because if... The artists back in that era, handful of them were lucky enough to release some books. You can't find them. They're out of print. And when you do find them, somebody want $300 for them. And it's like, uh, so what do you do? So then I decided, you know, hey, let me just sit down and just start tabbing some of this stuff because it's not extremely difficult. The only difficult stuff I ran across is like Earth, Wind & Fire stuff, Anita Baker stuff. I got all they sheet music. So when I play their stuff, I'm playing from the sheet music. I'm not guessing and trying to figure it out. Because it's pretty complex. But again, the purpose of, you know, compiling all of these is to help you guys learn your favorite songs from your era. So I'm going to extend this. I'm going to say it to about Tuesday. So again, if you're interested in taking advantage of this tremendous deal, you get over 300 songs of me walking you through the course and, and, and allowing you to, uh, you know, see what I'm doing and, and, and figuring it out or looking at it and understanding, um, you know, the uh, the songs and, and the chorus, you know, to these particular songs. So, again, if you're interested, uh, PayPal me. My PayPal information is right down here. Uh, send me uh, the, your funds, and once I receive your funds, I will send you an email. Please uh, check your email account to make sure that in your account uh, you have the following things. Your shipping address and your email address. Those are important. I don't want to delay the process of sending you your package. 
So once I receive your funds, I will quickly send you an email saying confirmation. I receive your funds and your DVDs go out the very next day. And for this package, I will provide tracking. I go to the post office, I get tracking. So I send you guys tracking information so you know exactly when your package is showing up at your door. And you international uh, subscribers that want to get in on this tremendous deal, by all means. But you will have to provide an additional $15 for shipping and handling because I've been to the post office several times. And that's around the guesstimate or estimate of how much it would cost to ship your package overseas. So again, you get... You get uh, the entire song books that's listed down here for the amazing price of $80. Uh, again, normally it would be over $400 if you were to buy them individually. So again, I'm just trying to put these in the hands of everybody that's really serious about playing songs that they love to play. Because if you're not going to become a professional musician like myself, you just want to play stuff that you want to play. Things that you love, the songs that you love. And, you know, I can help you get there, you know, because it's not always about I'm going to learn how to play the guitar, become a professional musician, make a lot of money. Some people got good jobs. They just want to play and relax and enjoy playing around their friends and family. So if that's you or if you are trying to go professional, these will help you get to wherever you're trying to go, regardless of where that where that is. So until next time, take care. And as always, I thank you guys for your support. And as always... Keep smiling.